Hi, my name is Melanie Albert. I'm the author of A New View of Healthy Eating, and I'm really happy to be here today with SpiritualAdrenaline.me and their holiday dessert guide. So today what we're going to do is prepare an avocado, yes, an avocado pudding. So it, it, it's really, really simple. We have a few ripe organic avocados, and the way you can tell that they're ripe is that they actually turn brown, like almost black, and they're soft to the touch. The avocados don't grow brown on their tree, they grow green, and then they get ripe after that. So it's really important to have a nice soft brown avocado. We also have some delicious medjool dates. So the dates are a really great sweetener. They're low glycemic, they won't spike your blood sugar, and I'm so fortunate they literally grow right here in my neighborhood. We are using a couple of little teaspoons of vanilla. And if you want, you can also use a vanilla bean. And if you use a vanilla bean, it's about one teaspoon of vanilla equals about one vanilla bean. Our other ingredient is our chocolate. So this is raw cacao powder, which is just amazing. So it's a really good antioxidant and just a really, really healthy dessert. And then we're gonna add water. So that's it. We have our avocados and we will cut into the avocado nice and gently. Yeah, and there we have it. It has a little bit of brown in there, so I'll definitely take that off. But what we're going to do is we are going to squeeze our avocados right into the blender. Taking out our pit. So if you want to grow an avocado tree, you can take that avocado pit and you can put it into water with the pointy side up and you will ultimately grow an avocado tree. My parents have a tree that they started probably about 10 years ago and after about the eighth year we actually had avocados growing in Florida. So it's a fun thing to do and I recommend that for everybody. So we're just putting in our avocados. They're looking nice and green and festive. Avocados are a really awesome healthy fat. So a plant fat, monounsaturated fat. And it's crazy. When I think about it that I'm even making a dessert with avocados, it makes me laugh. I was teaching a class at Whole Foods a couple of years ago and we made this avocado dessert, this avocado pudding for the people that were taking this diabetes class and no one even guessed that avocados were in it. So if you want to fool your friends, you can make this little avocado <laughs> dessert and have some fun knowing that they're going to get some really good healthy fats. So we put our avocados into the food processor. We actually put our dates into the food processor. We add our vanilla into the food processor, our raw cacao into the food processor our water <laughs> and this is it we are going to put the top on and we will turn it on and we're going to have an avocado pudding so we're just going to turn the food processor on so we've blended our chocolate pudding oh maybe for about two or three minutes and we're going to check it and I'm basically going to put it into a bowl, um, decorate it a little bit with some raspberries, and we'll put it into the refrigerator for a couple of hours, and then we will have our avocado pudding as a really great dessert. So this is a healthy dessert, really clean sweetener with the dates, very, very simple to make, and our healthy fats with the avocados. So Tom, I'm excited to be here to let you try the avocado pudding. Have you ever had a pudding made with avocados uh, and chocolate before? I didn't before? think it'd be possible to make a dessert with avocados, specifically a pudding. <laughs> so I'm really interested. What's in this? Well, it's avocados, it's dates, and it's raw cacao, mm -hmm. and a little bit of water and a little bit of vanilla, and that's it. That's really amazing. So you're getting healthy fats, mm -hmm. you're getting antioxidants, mm -hmm. uh, you, it's in a low glycemic load, index um, the dates correct mm -hmm. and then you have a you mentioned earlier magnesium as well for muscles and heart health um, <laughs> is there something do you focus on trying to get anti-inflammatories or anything specific into these types of desserts well I do I do I really have based all of my writing and my cookbook around the anti-inflammatory way of eating Why? well 
one of the theories is, and a lot of people are talking about this, a lot of the MDs agree with this right now, that inflammation is the root cause of many diseases. Mm -hmm. So it could be the root cause of heart disease, diabetes, stroke, right. any of the brain health. I mean, it's really important to keep the inflammation down in our body. We get so much inflammation in our body with stress and the bad food that we, if we can do something with food to keep inflammation down, mm -hmm. it's helpful. For people in the spiritual adrenaline community, you know, this is a major concern because people who have a history of substance abuse also often have stressed internal mm -hmm. organs, the kidneys, the livers, okay. Okay, the pancreas, and they have many times other kind of related illnesses mm -hmm. that come along with long-term substance abuse. If they're smoking, it's inflammation in the lungs, etc. Et so these types of foods, not only are they healthy for the general population, mm -hmm. but if someone's in recovery from long-term substance abuse, this kind of a food, if it's delicious, not <laughs> only are you enjoying eating it and having a, a, a fun dessert, but you're also eating things, something that's helping to make you healthier mm -hmm. and reduce the inflammation. So it's a win-win across the board. And the best part is you can eat more of it. Because it's not made <laughs> with the cheap stuff, you know, so it's really good for you. So let me give it a shot and see what it tastes like. That's absolutely delicious. When I was a little boy, I used to make um, the chocolate pudding out uh -huh. of the box. It tastes wow. exactly the same. That's crazy. <laughs> exactly the same. Well, that wasn't as healthy to me, but this is phenomenal. And, the, and the, the raspberries as well. Awesome, awesome. So if you're interested in this recipe and other similar healthy recipes that can enhance your recovery and you know, enable you to eat well, you can check out Melanie's new, co new book at A New View of Healthy Eating. Mm -hmm. And you can get that at her website, www.expnutrition.com. Happy holidays to you. Happy holidays. Thank you so much. This is amazing. My pleasure.